If you've ever sang happy birthday to a friend, you know how useful your voice can be. Brian Nichols grew up in a household with two deaf parents. Without a radio in the house for years, Nichols and his sister had an unconventional introduction to music. We would take my mom's keys and go outside to the car and listen to tapes in the tape deck uh, in that car. Now, he and his lab of graduate and undergraduate students are focused on music and people's voices. The Pitch Exploration Lab at Penn State does research into how singing and voice affect the brain. Topics include understanding the pitch range in familiar songs and helping people protect their voice. Members of the Pitch Exploration Lab were proud to display their projects in a showcase on campus. They say their research can help people find their voice. Scott Atchison is a PhD student in music education and a member of the lab. He says the projects benefit everybody, regardless of singing ability. If we can help people understand how their vocal habits change, that's going to help them later on have healthy habits. While the lab does higher level research, Nichols says the ultimate goal is for people to appreciate music and their own voice. Anything that contributes to how much people enjoy music or particularly how much people enjoy participating in music, we count that as a win. In University Park, I'm Steph Crane for the Center County Report. We hope you enjoyed watching the video. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel if you did. For the rest of our newscasts and featured stories, click here. And for sports, click here. Have a great day and thanks for watching.